perimeter. Let's go. So before we start, let's look at some vocabulary. Dimension, a measurement of distance in one direction. Okay, we are going to be looking at two different dimensions in this video, length and width. It's the distance and going in one direction. So my length would be going in one direction. All right, you see these two are going in the same direction as the length. And then the width is going in another direction. All right. Now, it doesn't really matter which one you call the length and which one you call the width, just so you know. All right, perimeter is the distance around a figure. And that's what we're going to be focusing on in this video. Perimeter, again, we said it's the distance around a figure. So let's check this out. Let's say each one of these little symbols right here represent one centimeter. Okay, well, let's count this. We got one centimeter, two centimeters, three centimeters, four centimeters. So if that's the top part of my rectangle, I know that the length is four centimeters. Okay, and so let's check the width, one centimeter, two centimeters. My width is a total of two centimeters. Now the thing about rectangles is that they just don't have one side as the length and one side as the width. Whatever is on this side is also gonna be over here as well. So let's keep counting the, the length and the width. So we got one, two, three, four centimeters again, and then one, two centimeters again for the width. So really I'm doing four plus two plus four plus two. So let's count this one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12 centimeters. My perimeter is 12 centimeters. Again, perimeter is the distance around a figure. So this time let's pretend that this symbol represents one foot. All right, so this is one, two, three, four, five, six feet. So my length is six feet and then my width is, oh no, it's just one foot, oh well. Okay, so I got a length of six feet and a width of one foot. Now again, like we said before, we're not just gonna do the top and the right, we gotta also do the bottom and the left. So it's not gonna just be six plus one, it's six plus one plus six plus one. All right, you got it. So let's see, we got six feet, seven feet, eight feet, nine feet, 10 feet, 11 feet, 12 feet, 13 feet, 14 feet. All right, so my total perimeter is 14 feet. And you might have just done six plus six is 12, 13, 14, however you do it, I don't know. All right, here we go. This time, okay, again, distance of uh, the perimeter is the distance around a figure. But this time, let's start off with the rectangle already there. And we'll determine the length as eight meters and the width is 15 meters. So let's go ahead and mark that on our rectangle. But remember, we're not just adding 15 plus eight because the rectangle has four sides. So we're counting up all the sides. It's the distance around the entire figure. 15, eight, 15, eight. So I know that 15 plus 15 is 30, so that's 30 meters. I know 8 plus 8 is 16, so that's 16 meters. And so 30 plus 16 is a total of 46 meters. So my perimeter is 46 meters. All right, let's try a word problem now. Jim's neighborhood is a rectangular shape. He wants to jog along the outside of his neighborhood. Jim's neighborhood is two miles wide and three miles long. How many miles will Jim jog? All right, well, the first thing I know is that the width is two miles, it's two miles wide, and the length is three miles, so that's three miles long. But am I just adding two plus three? No, I know that's a temptation. You see the number two and three, and we're adding that together, but that's not all, because remember, it's a rectangle. So I have a width of two miles, so that's two on both sides and three on both sides. So I'm doing two plus three plus two plus three. And if that's a little confusing, let's draw a picture of it. And so here's what it will look like. Two miles is the width, three miles is the length, and then another two miles the width, three miles of the length, because it's a rectangle, it's four sides. And so, you know, two plus three plus two plus three, that's a total of 10, so it's 10 miles. Jim will jog 10 miles. I'm sorry, that got cut off right there. All right, and we're done.